for you. Officially broken. Two casts. Now you know, don't buy this from Timo. Timo? Not impressed. Mm. Guys, 30 pound Timo challenge. So we went on Timo with a 30 pound budget to buy rod, reel, line, lures, everything we need to catch a fish. We actually did these last year with 50 pounds. And funny enough, last year we had a flat tire when we did this video. Yeah, we got a flat tire. Two hour road trip, 12 minutes from home, tire goes bang. Anyway, let's see what we have here, guys. One thing to keep in mind when we did the 50 pound Timo challenge, that's when I downloaded the app for the first time. So we had tons of discounts, which at the time I thought they're not real. Thought, ah, you know, just everything costs 100 quid and they sell for 20. But I struggle to do this 30 pound challenge, guys. Okay, guys, so this is the rod. We're going to leave this for last. Let's check what I have on the small one. Honestly, it's been so long. It's been sitting up there in my room for like months and months. Okay, so first, just a pack of tiny creatures and chartreuse. Was tough, guys, to make these a 30 pound challenge, not going to lie. Really difficult, but yeah. I think any perch will go for these. If we can throw these with a combo with hot, I'm not sure really. <laughs> I hope so. Oh yeah, we got line as well. 15 pound, I believe. It's fluorocarbon, by the way. Oh yeah, so we got a tiny, tiny pack. Let's see if you guys can see there. We have some paddle tails, we have some beads, uh, bullet weights, weedless hooks. Yeah, basically this is all we have up to now, guys. And basically, from what I see, we just have rod and reel. And let's check this reel, guys. The box is in bad condition. Hopefully, it's not broken. There's not much information on it. I think the reel costs like seven or eight pounds. That's the cheapest weight caster I've ever bought. Feels clunky. You can feel all the gearings. Well, it does have a click on the drag and a click oh it had a click oh yeah it has a click on the spool tension as well surprising a bit worried about this so i'm going to take an extra reel with me just to make sure okay guys let's open the rod now well same brand as on the last Timo challenge sugi lang well the last one did hold up quite well so i'm not going to say anything bad about it let's check this beauty out Actually looks really good. I think it's five to 15 grams or something like that. One good thing compared to the other one as well, guys, is not super flimsy, not a noodle. It actually feels quite a bit decent. One thing is missing straight away that I can tell. It could do with a couple more guides here. One, two, three, four, five, which is not ideal. But I'm liking these more like a fast action rod. I'm liking it straight away. It's not going to be the prettiest combo ever. But hey, 30 pounds, we can't choose that much. What should I think? Not super bad, is it? So basically, this is all we got with 30 pounds. Not too bad, not too bad. Let's pull this up, rig this up, and let's see what we catch with this. You can always use your door to hold the spool while he's pulling these guys. All rigged up. Only thing I didn't do was use the Texas rig because I'm using a wire trace, guys. Just, I know there's a chance of catching pike with these. Yeah, I tied on the little creature first. Oh, I mean, we don't have much to look, to choose from then, anyway. It's just the creature or either the paddle tails. But hopefully, we're going to catch you guys. Let's dial these in first. So, brakes in the middle. Spool tension kind of in the middle. Yeah. <coughs> Whoa. Glad I have a spare reel. What was that? Oh yeah, okay, okay. We managed one cast at least. Okay. 
casting wise it feels decent bad but decent for the price I mean eight pound reel so, yeah. oops it's not reeling in for some reason <laughs> this has to be the worst reel ever what it's not reeling in guys it's not reeling in oh yeah it's really in again oh this is the worst reel i've ever owned this is bad guys i think it's broken two <laughs> casts oh this is not moving the line guide <laughs> oh that's so bad let me see if i can do something to it guys before we give up officially broken two casts yeah guys i, I tried it worked for another second but this no good so I have here the cheap reel as well so we're not going to well it's out of the budget but it's like a 30 pound reel or so as well so but yeah this one works hopefully the rod don't break on us because I don't have a spare rod though <laughs> yeah guys now you know don't buy this from Timo here we have our quantum invade let's see let's try and cast this oh yeah way much smoother Ah, definitely wanted to catch with the other one guys though but... Oh yeah, we are on <laughs> Little jack pike guys on the creature On the Timo creature and on the team of rod he's in first cast with the new reel i wish i was with the other one but well team of rod team of lures so still still challenging guys it's a tiny little fish but it's a start let's start for the team of challenge yeah let's release him guys nice little jack pike baby ready to go buddy when you want Thanks for biting, dude. I guess it's a start, guys. I mean, we have tiny lures, even though we've been here with micro lures and caught some big fish, but my goal is just to catch and put these to the test. The reel failed straight away, but the rod and the lures working up to now. Let's see if we catch a few more, guys. The little chartreuse creature is still in one piece, I guess. Yes, it is. I mean, nothing special to it, to be fair, but I guess the little pike wanted it. And I'm tangled. Oh man, disappointed with the reel. <laughs> rod feels decent though. Impressively, it's quite sensitive to be honest. Well, let's try one of the paddle tails now. They look really good actually. They have little eyes, ribbed body. They look actually quite decent. I think I've used them before. I think I had a pack of these in chartreuse. Oh yeah, looks beautiful the action on it. Yep, quite decent, quite decent the action guys. Yeah, I, I can't jig these on the bottom here guys, I'm going to lose them. Stock is getting low on wire traces, jig heads and also I'm not going to risk it. Rod feels nice actually, loads really well, I'm throwing 7 grams. So it might be correct those 5 to 15 or something that they claim. Let's try this little spot here guys again. It's been giving us some decent perch and actually a decent pike which I'm not looking forward to. But maybe will give us a decent perch again. Who knows? Let's pray to the perch gods guys. I'll just try and jig it because I know perch like these jigs off the bottom. Pike like them too. <laughs> I can't just pray that we don't have a pike coming for this. Guys, 
can't believe I wasn't recording. I don't think I was recording. Nice perch on, again on the creature. I just cast it closer to the to the weir. And yeah, little chunk here. Straight away on the drop. We need to see if we find a couple more. But it's a nice fish. Nice fish. Cheers, buddy. There he goes, head first. 10 out of 10. Let's try again. Cast down there again. It might be another one, so you guys can see me actually. Catching the perch on it. Ah, he annoys me when I'm not recording. There's got to be another one there, guys. The problem is every time I catch one here, then we don't catch more, so... Cast much, much better now, guys. I had the, the line tangle around the rod, didn't even realize. It's just one of those days. Line tangle around the rod, not recording, you know. We still managed to catch two fish, though. But yeah, just one of those days that I'm not my best. Oh, he casts like a dream now. Well, for some reason, they're not liking these paddle tails, but they look really good and swim really good. I don't think it's the paddle tails actually, it's more like uh, they're not really chasing anything at this point. Yeah guys, it's day two and we're trying to catch some perch. I changed the reel again, I put my Casting Centron on it. He looks sick. Cheap combo looks sick. Yeah, um, I changed to a Texas rig, so I'm using the hooks, the weight, the beads that came on the little tackle box. Man, they keep jumping. I just see bait fish jumping, bait fish jumping. Yeah, we got one, guys. We're freaking out. Oh, not a pike. It feels like a pike. Yeah, it's a tiny jack. Again, same size as the first one. Same size as the first one. Oh, I lost my freaking net. I see. So, it's you there after this little roach. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, in the net. It's not the perch I'm looking for, but I'll take it. Come here, buddy. Chill, 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 chill. Yeah, guys, little guy again. It's been tough. I'm not going to lie. It's been really tough. So anything, I'll take it. To be honest. Baby pike. You go, buddy. Thanks for biting, dude. I guess changing to the charge rules made, made a difference. Yeah, we casted all this area with the white. No, no bites. Changed to the charge rules. First few casts. I don't even know if it was the first cast or not. We had a bite straight away. Yeah, I'll take it. There's uh, three fish landed, guys, on the Timo gear. I mean, apart from the reel, <laughs> but, well, can't really do anything about that. I don't know, guys, I feel like these last few videos, the fish have get, been getting smaller and smaller. Honestly, it's just been so tough. As much as I want to catch a big one, for you guys to see. I, I just can. Okay guys, we walked the beat, we cast it around quite a lot. I'm not going to put that in the video because nothing really happened. Not a single fish to be seen. Changed lower back to the chart rules. Oh yeah, we had a bite straight away, tiny perch. It feels good. <laughs> Just to have a bite after so long, might just go back to the creature then if they're here. Oh yeah, we got another bite here. Exact same spot. It's funny that we caught on this lot. There's 
it has barely no action since we already caught on both floors both creature and paddle cell I might just try something different just to see if they bite I'll try I have a few other lures with me I know they're not part of Timo but really want to catch another fish you guys so yeah I might just try something different I'm going to try this pro freestyle urban prey I do see some bait fish here in this area as well so we might have some luck here oh yeah we had a hit yeah we got one guys doesn't feel too bad yeah it's not big but and it's not on the team all the way it's a fish i mean it's been a struggle any fish will come <laughs> beautiful you got buddy thanks for biting yeah guys it wasn't the easiest of the days fishing but to be honest last few weeks has been a struggle i think all the fish just getting smaller and smaller but it was fun to record this <laughs> the reel just broke two casts into it well the rod is quite decent actually and i actually like it a lot now paired with the casting centrum just looks really cool yeah, i hope you guys enjoyed the video thanks a lot to everyone who's been watching the videos leaving comments likes all those things i really appreciate that guys and yeah i'll see you guys on the next one